So this is a short video of some of the highlights of our week-long trip to uh, the Isle of Man TT. A nice easy run over on the ferry, a comfortable trip. Just arriving at our digs for the week, which is the Silly Moose campsite just outside Ramsey. Really recommend this, great place. Plenty of space, good facilities. I had a band on one night and camp feel brilliant. Can't recommend that enough. Got pitched and ready for a week of sightseeing and obviously of, of watching the racing on uh, a brilliant little island. Really enjoyed it. Absolutely stunning. Wow, fantastic. Our first experience of the TT was watching it at the edge of the campsite as the, the warm-up laps came past. Incredible. Jesus. We also watched the Super Twin race at this point as well and watched the eventual winner, Peter Hickman, come past at a heck of a pace. Really impressive. Next up we did a bit more sightseeing, this through the beautiful Salby Glen, uh, up to the top of the mountain to Bungalow. Beautiful day now. Superb. Keep this up people. Yep. Gorgeous, look at this, wow. This is an absolutely fantastic piece of road that runs up from Salby Crossroads all the way up to the Bungalow. Uh, it's an absolutely fabulous drive or ride all on its own. Um, but great because when you get to the end uh, of the road up over the top uh, you reach the back of the bungalow so this road is open uh, even when the roads are closed or obviously you can't go across Solby Crossroads because that's shut as well but when you get up to the bungalow there's um, plenty of parking either on the road or as you get right up to the bungalow there's plenty of motorbike parking up behind the cafe itself and a great place to spectate from as well Definitely worth wrapping up warm though, because uh, even when it's a nice sunny day down at the bottom up on the mountain, it can be pretty windy and chilly. We managed to watch a couple of races up here, and sadly the sidecar race was uh, called off, um, unfortunately, uh, due to the problems at the bottom. But uh, we had a very nice windswept afternoon. We got back to the campsite, hoping the tents would still be there, because it was pretty windy, and half the tents in the place had disappeared. We then followed that up with uh, the day after, go in for the main seniors race at uh, Solby Strait and up to Solby Bridge and that was a real spectacle with the speed those guys go there. So we finished up with a bit more sightseeing around the island, enjoying the delights of Peel and uh, went to see a few of the other places we've been before. Uh, and obviously no trip would be complete without a blat around the TT course while the roads are closed up on the mountain, set to one way and uh, no speed limits so you can uh, go and have a bit of fun within reason uh, which we did, which was a, a fantastic end to the week and a, and a really great experience so uh, happily go back and do that again sometime Kate's Cottage, what a view, look at this Douglas over there. Beautiful, isn't it, that? Yeah. 